Hey. I'm a sixth grader who goes to Edger Elementary School. I always like to eat from a young age and love sweets. But there's one thing that I can't eat. It was shellfish, like shrimp and crab. If I eat them, I break out in hives and collapse. Thanks to that, I can't eat lunch and my mom cooks me bento. It's a little sad that I can't eat what everyone else eats, but I can deal with it. That's because I have friends. Wow! Your bento looks so good! <laughs> Thank you! But your bento looks so healthy too! Y you think so? Her name is Asuchi Chan. She's my classmate and bento friend. Unlike me though, she has no allergies. Then why isn't she eating her lunch? Apparently it's because of her mom's direction. I'm sure it's good for your body, but it's a little... flavorless. Really? Want me to give you some of my patty then? There's a lot of sauce and... Th thank you. But I'm okay. Mom is going to chew me out if I do. Right. I don't think she noticed we didn't say anything. So Suji tells mom is very pushy about organic foods. And so that's all Sasuji can eat. That's fine, but she also is not into any seasoning that isn't organic either. Apparently, she claims that if you get used to strong flavors, you'll start getting stuck into junky flavors too. As a result, her bentos are almost always really bland. <sighs> Things were so unflavorable when Dad was around. Really? Yeah. She would use things that weren't completely organic to go with my dad, but... After they got divorced, she stopped doing that, too. But that's rough. Huh. <sighs> but I guess she's really concerned with sushi chans health that much. Can't blame her for that, I guess. Oh! Oh yeah, Yuri-chan! Mm hmm? What's up? I told my mom about you and she said she'd love to have you over sometime. Do you want to come over? Really? I'd love to go. I've never been over to Sasuji Chan's house. I'm so excited. That's why. I was heading out to Sasuji Chan's house on Saturday to hang out. I felt like it'd be a rude to show with nothing. So I bought some organic chips at the nearby market. It was so much more expensive than I thought. But this is all I can eat with Sasuji Chan. Hello! Oh, Yuri-chan, welcome! Hello, you must be Yuri-chan. Welcome. This is her mom, huh? She seems kind enough. Nice to meet you, ma'am. This is just a small gift. What is this? It's just some snacks that I bought from the store. It's organic so she can eat them too. Not necessary. Huh? Organic snacks are apparently becoming more and more flavorful. No. Sasuji's tongue is going to become stupid if she gets used to it. She's gonna want stronger flavors and keep eating dirty foods. Right. It was so expensive though. Okay. Ignore these horrible snacks and come on in, Yuri-chan. So, sure. Sorry, she's not trying to be mean. But it's okay. Diet is one of these things you can't control. Well, whatever, can I go to your room? Let's hang out there. I yeah. There is nothing that would play because I can only assume it was her mom's policy. We drew things and hung out. It started getting late and then... Yuri-chan, would you like to eat dinner here? Dinner? Yeah. We've only got foods that are good for you, so I think you'll love it. D don't be pressured to say yes. Mom's foods is really bland, so it might not be good. Um, but she says she'll cook for me. Hang on. I'm going to get started on it right now. I've never actually eaten Suzuki-chan's bento before. I wonder if she's a good chef. 
I was excited, but... Here you are. Wow! Thank you so... much. A veggie salad appeared in front of me. Nothing other than that. Just salad. No me or dressing either. What is it, Yuri-chan? Are you not going to eat? I prepared it just for you. Huh? Oh, so sorry. Thank you. Uh, right. She made it for me. I've got to eat. Huh? What is this? I can taste something other than veggies. <laughs> Yuri-chan, are you okay? Is this... There's shrimp in this! Huh? N no way! There is! It's finely diced! But... I wonder if Suji chan didn't tell her mom about my allergies! Oh no... I can't... Yuri-chan? Wake up, Yuri-chan! Wake up! That was the last thing I remembered hearing at her house. When I came to, I was in a hospital bed. Apparently, they had managed to save my life. But my whole body was covered in hives, and I was in the hospital for a few days. I was in the hospital, and my dad and mom came to visit me every day. Then I learned something shocking. Huh? Should she intentionally put in the shrimp? Yeah, I can't believe it. My mom made sure that I'd be fine before heading to Susuji chans house to check on why she added shrimp. Then Susuji chans mom said this. Yes, I put shrimp in there on purpose. I knew that she had food allergies. What? Wh what the hell were you thinking? For what? Because it's impossible. Natural food cannot be harmful to the body. What? Think whoa, about whoa, it. Whoa, whoa. People have grown up into what they are now thanks to all this shellfish that we ate. That's why there's no way that could cause harm to the body unlike all the additives and preservatives that we consume. Y you What are you- Shellfish allergies are just a lie. And there are some companies that know they're in trouble if that comes out into the light of day so they blame shellfish. I'm sure it was other additives and preservatives that they're reacting to. You're a parent, too, so how about you do your research, huh? I feel bad for Yuri-chan. You little... Ah! You should be praising me for not kicking your ass on the spot. Hey, Yuri, compliment me. Good, good job. Whatever the case, what happened after that? I went home and talked to your dad. And I think that we're going to sue her. Huh? You her? Of course. One second later and you might have died. I can't just let this go. Mom. Yuri, you are more important to me than my own life. If you died, I don't know what I would have done. Please be more careful for me too. There may be more strange and terrifying people like her in the world. Yeah. Mom and Dad really took her to court. They were victorious by a landslide. Tsuji chans mother, yasuri san was forced to pay damages. Not only that, this whole series of events caused parental rights to shift to Tsuji chans father. yasuri san left the house that is now a shut-in in her parents' house. Then... Wow! Her bento looks so good! Yeah, Dad made it for me. Huh, he's got a cooking? Is it all organic? I don't know. It really is good, though. <laughs> then I guess it doesn't matter. No one knows about these events. Apparently, Mom told her friends to make sure her word doesn't get around because she didn't want Tsuji to have to deal with any repercussions from her mother's actions. Thanks to that, we continue to be friends. However... Hey, Yuri-chan. Hmm? What is it? Well, I got a letter from my mom a little while ago. Huh? Yes, sir, you son. Yeah. What did it say? I'm sorry about before, Suzuji chan I'm sorry for being mean. I'm sure I put a little too much salt on the salad. 
It was organic salt, but you really can't trust seasoning anymore. Also, maybe all of her seasoning infested life has been causing her immune system to weaken. Sasuji, you are her friend and make sure she eats raw shrimp. If it's small boiled shrimp, I'm sure she'll notice. The great parts of all organic foods. I see. She hasn't learned at all. Yeah, I don't think she's going to change at all. If you ever run into her again, don't talk to her. I don't know what she's going to do. Okay. If you would explain allergies, it's the overreaction of your body against a foreign object. Maybe you can call the overreaction of the mind to something normal. Insanity. ご視聴いただきありがとうございました。自然界のものに対して絶対的な信頼、そしてアレルギーなんてないと信じていることはわかりました。しかしそれを強要しないで、自分の生活の中で完結しておけば何も問題は起きなかったことでしょうに。自分の考えのせいで、目の前の子供が